CIA analysts name it the Caspian Sea Monster. Its shape suggests some kind of flying craft, but it's too big to be a regular plane. The length of this thing is anywhere between 350, 400 feet. The wingspan is maybe only 100 feet. How is that going to fly? If it's an entirely new type of flying craft, it's twice the size of the largest commercial airline built to date, the giant 747. Such a machine could deliver an enormous nuclear payload. This is really frightening. The CIA had to get in there and get more intel to figure out exactly what's going on. The CIA commissions an ambitious new task force. Declassified records reveal it greenlights Project Aqualine, the development of a top secret surveillance program based in Area 51. Somebody says, hey, how about a bird? <laughs> That's really a drone taking pictures. And they say, sure, let's do it. Well, this is actually the start of our drone program. The Project Aqualine drone looks like a bird. It glides like a bird. But it's the first ever unmanned airplane with a camera for a head. The problem is, is at this time, it was very difficult to fly such a thing. So they kept crashing it in the tests. It was too risky. They couldn't use it for this. Eventually, continuing reconnaissance from the Corona Satellite Project yields the data the CIA analysts need. What it reveals is terrifying. The mystery craft is neither a plane nor a boat, but a deadly hybrid. It's a boat that flies. And it's a boat that flies only a few feet off the ground. A plane moves forward, displaces the air. The idea is if you're close enough to the ground, the air forces back up, maintains lift. That was, in very simple terms, the theory behind this plane. It has the weapons payload of a ship, the speed of a plane, and it's almost impossible to see coming. The most beautiful part about this design is it flies so low, it flies right underneath radar. So when you think about it, this can just appear out of the middle of nowhere. They could be invading San Francisco in three hours, and we wouldn't know they were there until they arrived. It's mind-blowing.